Hello everyone, the Onyx Console Player Center has been updated again. I have installed the ZOR 5.11 version with game library. If you want to install the version without game library, you can download it on our official website. The Onyx Console version with game library allows players to directly click the setting on the right of the game library to check for updates, and then just press the button to conduct online updates. Now let me introduce what has been updated in the new Onyx Console. First of all, we optimize its internal code so that programs occupy less memory when running, and the running speed will be faster due to no occupation of the process amount in the background. Secondly, a small window can pop up on the game library interface, directly overlaying on top of the game library. In the past, users had to return to the desktop if they want to pop up the small window. While now the keyboard and the small window can pop up at any interface in the game library. Thirdly, we also add a curve control feature for the fan. Look here, fan mode, real-time speed, temperature, automatic mode, preset E and preset R are available. Press the Y button to pop up the preset 1 and preset 2 curve setting interface. We activate preset 1. If you want to make the fan run slowly to keep the device quieter at night, or if you want the fan to run faster to keep the device temperature lower, you can set up the curve here. The current temperature is 40 degrees and the fan speed is 45. We can set the speed to 25 when the temperature is 45 degrees, and set the speed to over 30 when the temperature is 60 degrees. The fan may need to spin faster when the temperature is 70 degrees. After setting is finished, you can select preset E, and then the preset 1 that we have just set will be activated. Same goes for preset 2. If you want to restore it to a straight line after messing up the preset curve points, you can click off the points to return the curve to a straight line. The feature is quite practical. Well, that's all for this video.